time for manga time again! Yay! I'm Kaneko here with uh, my new special special guest host, uh, Nana Sabashi. So let's, let's welcome Nana! Yay! Um, we've got uh, quite a bit to talk about here, which is not going to be just about manga. So we could also call this manga and anime time if we want. Because we're going to talk about some DVDs and lots of just crazy manga and anime merchandise and t-shirts and patches and pins and stickers and you can drown in all of the, the merchandise that, that we have here. But Don't first, worry, all you non-anime manga fans, we have some things for you too. <laughs> we do. Don't worry. We're, we're not excluding you <laughs> from the awesome that is upstairs. Because we have more than just anime DVDs up here. Yes, we do. So, uh, what about some of those? Those non-anime non -anime DVDs. Non -anime DVDs. Well, I have this. It's an all-time favorite, and they re-released it. It's Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh Ooh. my god. Yeah. Basically, I know, everyone knows that there was another box set to this. <laughs> but this one comes with... The Jess, Jason and Freddy versus Freddy that was never included in the other box set. So this is eight discs of all the eight movies that came out for Nightmare on Elm Street. That's a whole lot of scaring you. Yes, it in, is. In, in one box. <laughs> yes, it this, is. This is a terrifying box right here. I don't even want to be near this <laughs> because I hate horror movies. Come on, come on. Can you go? Can you go? No liking. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. Then well. we have. Fantastic Mr. Fox. I don't know if you guys ever read the book. It's based off a book. Like a lot of things nowadays, based off of a book. That's <laughs> right. right. Everything. Why create anything new? <laughs> <laughs> so Fantastic Mr. Fox is a whole lot of funness with Fox. There's, yeah. there's occasionally moles and other creatures that crawl on the ground. But it's mostly foxes. But it's mostly foxes. Okay. Alright, but... We're gonna go back into, you know, what we're here for, which is the anime and manga. Of course. So, you know. I wouldn't look this adorable if I wasn't. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. So, what have we got? We got some. Well, I have some for you, Naruto fans. Oh, God. You guys Naruto are all over the place. Shippuden. Yeah. I have the first box set and the second box set to the first season. Wow, that's so, like everything you need right there. Exactly. I mean, come on. Naruto, his sexy self, who doesn't <laughs> want him? You know, and he's all grown up now. Yeah, he's, he's, looking, he's looking all serious and grown up. <laughs> he knows what's going on. Look at that look face. Look at that, that face. Yeah. All you in see that face? <laughs> he knows what's up. Then we have this creepy, I don't know why they put Nadara on the cover of this box. His hand creeps me out. <laughs> I would not let him touch me. Okay? <laughs> that is not pretty. That's okay? Not okay. I don't know who agreed to this, but with every handsomeness, there is always ugliness. <laughs> <laughs> and we have one more DVD, which is. Oh, yeah. Magic Knight Ray Earth. For all you Clamp fans. And if you're just starting to be a Clamp fan, there is absolutely no reason that you should not watch this. It's season one, the 15th anniversary. Yeah, it's been around. Yeah, it's been around a while, 15th anniversary. I haven't seen an anime box set that had that written on it. Yeah. 15th anniversary, come on. That already That's writes hardcore. on it that you have to get it. Oh, if yeah. you haven't seen this, you have to see it. Because <laughs> it's awesome. It's awesome. And I mean, it's the whole thing. Who doesn't think this little thing is adorable? <laughs> come on. Bring it up there. Show it. Show yeah. it up close. I don't think they Look can see how cute no, and adorable. Not. Come on. Look at that. Adorable, adorable. Little, little cuddle thing Who? sleeping on a flower. Yeah. Come on. Who wants, like everyone should want one of these. Just like everyone should want a Pikachu. Pikachu. I would prefer Pikachu because at least he can do something. This one's just going to kill you with cute ones. Yeah. So I guess, you know, death by cute is, is not the worst, worst way to go. It's not the worst way to go. I gotta go. I would rather go <laughs> death by cute. cute. <laughs> Um, um, speaking of cute, actually, we have some new uh, merchandise in that's not particularly aimed at any kind of, you know, title, but it's equally adorable. What are you talking about? Talking about these 
crazy earphones. I have a pair of these. So why don't you tell us? Okay. Like, well, a little bit I have them. a pair of these. In actuality, I have this pair. I thought having cat palms in my ear would look so adorable. And were you correct? I was so correct. Oh, I was so right. correct. If anyone, everyone stopped me and asked me where did I get my headphones, and of course, Say I told them at Forbidden Planet. I mean, come on. Yeah. If you want anything awesome, it will be at Forbidden Planet. Yeah. But, come on. If you like cuteness, you'll love these little paw earrings. If you're a big sushi fanatic and yeah. love to eat sushi, you can't stop thinking about sushi. Because it's so good. So yummy. These things would be perfect for you. As well as there's other ones as well. We have a banana one. Yeah. For the crazy monkey in you. <laughs> and we have the Frankenstein bolts. For the horror fan in you. For the you. horror fan in you. Yeah. You just feel like being a little stiffy. Want everybody to stay away from you. Yeah. Put those bad boys in your ears. Just be like, <laughs> Leave me alone. That's my seat on the subway. I'm listening to my music. Leave me be. Fire bad. <laughs> But also, just in case you want to know about the volume quality, these bad boys are pretty loud. So I would suggest not to put them deep inside your ears. Because you <laughs> will go ears. deaf. Yeah. <laughs> or any other holes. Yeah. Okay, people? Or nowhere in your nose. Not in your mouth. It's not where sound it, comes right, in. It's not where it goes. It's not where it goes. In your ears, yeah. okay? Not even your belly button, because it can't hear what is going on. No. These are made for your ears, people. <laughs> your crazy ears. I just have to put it out there just in case we have a little funnies yeah. out there. We know the girl, instructions you know. are kind of not in English. <laughs> they're not in English. No, so you could have took it up as, hey, yeah. my belly button is anywhere. Your music. Oh, can't. let me put it up my nose. It's a nose plug. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> okay, you're up to buy something different if, if that's what you mean. And I don't think that's too cute and adorable, no. so I don't think it's not that. No. But it's a little too crazy. <laughs> For the crazy ears. Yeah. Crazy. But we're going to move on to our other merchandise here at Forbidden Planet. Right, like we nice. have uh, keychains and patches and, and wristbands and pins for your bags. We have messenger bags, bags. period. We have t shirts. T shirts. Come oh, yeah. On. We got t shirts. Some, some lovely okay. t shirts. And we just got some new ones in, too, from Toki Doki. Yes, we did. You know, you, you all yeah. love Toki Doki. Oh, yeah. Now, it's, it's even cute though, and pop and fun and bright and everything you want of all cheapiness and, and cuteness. Oh yeah! But these Tokidoki T-shirts that we have is a mix of superhero cuteness. Basically, it has our favorite superheroes in an awesome combination with a Tokidoki character, like Captain America. And He's the cactus on a awesome skateboard <laughs> with the all-american meal haha <laughs> and some captain america yeah with an all-american meal in his brain he's like what else would he be thinking about you know While other he's walking the, the cactus park yeah come on any girl out there would adore and appreciate these lovely awesome shirts yeah. and you know what they made it specifically for us girls yeah because you know a lot of superhero shirts don't come in girl sizes. No, they don't. You're but stuck they in made. Dudes. Yes, exactly. You have to get a small men's size. But the awesome thing about this that it, it is in women. So we have them in sizes small to extra large, and it costs twenty five dollars. I know it kind of sounds a little pricey, but for Toki Doki, that's that good. is a deal. That, that is, is a deal. steal because those shirts are kind of pricey. If you own any of them, you know. Yeah. You gotta sell an arm and a leg for those bad boys. Yes, you do. But you can come here to Forbidden Planet and get this awesome Captain America shirt or this awesome Hulk shirt where he's got himself two lovely ladies yeah. cheering on little, in the side of him. Little peppy cheerleaders. Pepping up his hulkiness. Yeah. Hulk smash! I don't know how he can be so mad while he has know. two little cute adorable girls They're all by winking his at him and, and they're winking, like, so cute. doing like little cheers for Mr. Hulk. Yeah. Come on, my all time favorite. Because who doesn't? Okay. Love this guy? I own this shirt. I had to. Is Spidey 
climbing up again to get away from the cactus pus who's biting his butt. Come on. His yeah. little tush is getting bitten and he can't get away. Yeah. He's got a little sweat drop here. Oh, he's such a adorable character. My he's favorite shirt. Come on. But guess what? What happens in the back of the shirt? Yeah. You get Spidey again, and he's, he's ready the only for it. And he actually got away from the cup. He he this part. He's okay. But I think they put him twice just because he's so adorable as a yes. chibi. Come on. He's Look so at adorable. the two chibi little Spider Man. Climbing yeah, up on you. On. No. You wouldn't want Spider Man climbing on them. It's an awesome shirt. I own it. <laughs> I own that one. Just saying. Just saying. 